7th of September 2019 is the day that England played Bulgaria in the Euro qualifiers. Now the last time England played Bulgaria at Wembley this happened. So the game starts about 5 minutes in, played out onto the left. Uh, but then a nice left foot volley from Jermaine Defoe. And it's taken England less than three minutes. Jermaine Defoe finishing from six yards. And then England continue with their counter-attack uh, by playing it in a nice, decent through ball for Jermaine Defoe. Weak foot, nutmeg. Tremendous counter-attacking play from England. And then England looking for their third. Play it down the left to Jermaine Defoe, who then... Plays it into Wayne Rooney, and then plays it out on the right to Adam Johnson. He scores this time. It's the first international goal for Adam Johnson. And then Jermaine Defoe looking for his hat trick. Wayne Rooney plays it to the left of him, and it's a weak foot four nil Jermaine Defoe hat trick. A first England hat trick for Jermaine Defoe. Looks like he got a kick in the process. Wayne Rooney with the assist once again, his third of the night. But it's all about Jermaine Defoe. And there is the final whistle. Fantastic start to the 2012 qualifying campaign. Now, obviously, the last time England played, we beat Switzerland in the Nations League. <laughs> we lost the Netherlands, but I'm feeling a 4 5 nil. We When we play teams like Bulgaria, at Wembley, like especially at when we play at Wembley, we are um, incredible. And when we play little teams, we smash them 5 4 nil. So I'm gonna go with 5 nil England. Let's get in the stadium, let's hope for a win. Come on. It was a good save from Pickford, doing better than I thought. I did think it would be a bit of a walk in the park. Bulgaria looked like they're going to be a big challenge. Uh, yeah, he found the gap, very good save from Pickford. I still think they'll we'll win with a clean sheet, but they do look worrying. Chance for England, got the cross, just couldn't find the man, went out for a throw in. Looking up a very good game so far. Come on, Danny Rose. Oh. 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 Clearly offside. I don't know why people are cheering. But it's. Oh, they've actually got a chance now. I was going to say. Side. We are playing very, very well. We've had two or three chances in the first 20 minutes. And if anyone's going to score a goal, it's probably going to be us. Uh, really build up, just had to be offside. It was very, very unlucky. Uh, but yeah. Oh. 
half time 1 0. Uh, Bulgaria, it's weird they're 1 0 down, but they've been putting 10 men behind the ball. It's been difficult to break through, but they haven't been that much of a threat. I mean, they had a chance down there, but it's weird. I want to see how they come out for the second half because. They've not really been a threat, they've just been defensive, which is good, but when you're one nil down, it's, it's definitely not good. second half, uh, they had a chance, defended it pretty well, we went down the other end, I got a penalty, let's go. They were just messing around with it. Uh, and Raheem Sterling just nicked the ball and put it in the back of the net. That was Come on, you filthy whites! That was shocking from Bulgaria, but I'll take it. 3 0. I've just seen that. <coughs> what for FC flag? Sanchez Flores is back. He was no, he was literally my favourite manager back in 2016. This is unbelievable, mate. Pack your suitcases. We're going to Europe. This is unbelievable news. It just looks so beautiful and beautiful and beautiful and people doing the Mexican wave. That was such that was such a beautiful voice back. So this amount to make single name. Sancho, you know, right? It, it, it was all in. Yeah! Yeah! Nil, second time in a row we beat in Bulgaria at home 4-0. Um, shame I couldn't get some clickbait in there. Uh, learn from Fogden. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I do love Fogden as a geezer. But, um, it was a good 4-0 win. Two Harry Kane penalties. Followed up by Sterling and someone else. But no, nah, it was a good all-round performance. Bulgaria weren't too bad, but we were just better finishing and better at f football. They had a few chances, but just, they weren't really going to beat us if they finished finished them anyway. But drop a, hope you enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you're new. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.